Next drill is a two-man weave. We've got a couple of progressions with this drill. Basic drill, working on some really good solid fundamentals. We have a line here, a line here, and after this line, the player goes in this line, switches to this line, and this player switches in this line. But X1 to start will have the ball in his right hand, okay? And this player is going to have the ball in his left hand, have the stick in his left hand. X1 will roll the ball to X2. X2 will scoop the ball with his left hand. X1 follows the ground ball and will set a pick for X2. It's very important that X2 waits for the pick to be set. Otherwise, the pick is no good. And it's also very important for X2 to go outside the pick, not inside the pick. Because if he goes inside the pick, the pick is useless, okay? So he's got to go outside the pick. Then he's going to attack the goal and take a shot left-handed. A lot of touches, rapid fire, and we got to utilize the pick, and we got to make sure these players know to go outside. And once they get through the pick, attack the goal, and get a good quality shot over the top. So next progression, X2, once he goes around the pick, okay, X1 has set the pick. X1 is going to come around, set the pick, come around to the inside. X2 is going to the outside. Now X2 will now roll the ball back to X1. Now I believe X1, because he's going to be facing the ball, should have the stick in his left hand. He will now scoop the ball with his left hand, attack the goal, and take a good lefty shot. So it's important to have enough space in this drill to keep enough space so when he comes around, he can roll the ball like 10, 15 yards back to X1, and he's got to stay in a position where he has enough space to scoop the ball with his left hand and get a shot. 